What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I got the coffee behind me right here, getting brewed up. It's gonna be delicious. Today, we are gonna take on the military food challenge. So in this challenge, wait, let me rewind. For all of my new subscribers who do not know me, let me give you a little background. I've been lifting weights, practicing proper nutrition for over a decade, actually almost 13 to 14 years to be exact. That's why I make fitness videos. For you guys, for a lot of my subscribers that are OG subscribers, you came to this channel for fitness so that's why i bring you guys these fitness videos giving you guys some help some advice some knowledge on how to get better in and out of the gym because it's not about lifting the weights it's also about the proper nutrition very important so that's why i bring you these fitness videos now for my food challenge subscribers y'all love to see the food challenges i've done a few of them in the past and currently taking on a whole bunch of them got the family involved and it's going crazy guys we're having a good time so make sure you subscribe to this channel turn your notifications on and let's have some fun So good. So today we got a challenge. This one is not gonna be easy for some of you out there if you wanna take on this challenge. This is the military food challenge. 24 hours, nothing but military food. I'm sure not a lot of you know what military food is. Well, here it is. It's an MRE. This is meals ready to eat. So these are the meals that military personnel eat, mainly when they're out in the field, battle uniforms, ready for war, you gotta live outside of regular lifestyle. You're out in the trenches, you don't have a kitchen, you gotta have something in your backpack ready to go. So that's what meals ready to eat are. They are meals that are properly packaged that can last for like three years. Super durable, you can throw them all around. Now they have it where you can buy them in the stores. You can order them online. I think each one is probably around 1200 to 1500 calories. Do not quote me on that, I could be wrong. But you know what, I'm gonna do some research and it's on the screen right now. So that's how many calories are in each one. So if you have three of them, three, you can get through a whole entire day of some normal living and get the necessary calories you need in order to survive. We want our soldiers to be well fed when they're out there fighting for us, all right? So this is why they eat this. This is what they eat, not the best foods. Trust me, I've had them numerous of times. When I was in training for the Air Force, I probably didn't tell you that, but yes, I am in the Air Force. When I was in training, we ate MREs all the time and I actually love them. <laughs> I think they're pretty good, you know? So with me right now, I have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Three meals. This is gonna be a nice, fulfilled day of military food. So let's knock down meal one. All right, guys, so here we are with meal number one. I think they have over like 20 of these different menu items, all right? Inside of here, we'll have an entree, we'll have a side, we'll have probably some dessert, we'll have a drink. We're gonna bust it open, man. I'm gonna show you guys what's inside. We're looking at hash brown potatoes with bacon, peppers, and onions. So normally you can just pull this thing apart, guys. But maybe it might not be that easy for some. Hopefully you got your knife on you or something. I actually don't. It's in the house. It's okay. Use our strength. All right. Here we go. Everything is properly packaged. We have the nutrition facts on there. As you see, I have granola right here. We got some peanuts. We got cheese spread. Ooh, we got the apple turnover. Come on, guys. Look at that. We got some crackers, most likely for the cheese. And we have this right here. This is a cardboard piece. This is for heating up the hash browns and potatoes, which most likely it's right here. Just all, oh, just mushy. Oh man. Oh man, I don't know how good that's gonna be, guys. And then we have our drink right there. You see the drink. We got some wipes in there. We got some gum, because your breath is definitely gonna stink after eating all this crap. Look at that, they got coffee. I should have made this coffee instead of my delicious Starbucks coffee that I have right here. 
but you know, we might even still see what this is talking about. Got the creamer. Oh man, they hooked it up in here. Got some salt, some sugar. Got some matches, just wanna light some shit on fire. Got a napkin. All right guys, when you bust it open, they have the instructions on here, so it'll be all right. You'll get through it, all right? So I'm gonna read the instructions. Just watch me work. All right, guys, so we're gonna leave this right here and hopefully it does its thing. Let's see what else we got. Bust open these peanuts. Just regular old peanuts, guys. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. Mm. I've had better peanuts. We got dehydrated granola with milk and blueberries. You see that, guys? It's not looking like anything, really. It's just granola. I'm sure you guys had granola before. Maybe you had it. Try it out. That's what it's looking like. Mmm. I would not want to have to eat this. Oh, man. So dry. Need water. So we got some dry peanuts. We got some dry granola. We got crackers with some cheese spread. Let's see what we're getting into, guys. Regular crackers, you can actually break them up. Not too good. Got the cheese spread, I don't really do a lot of cheese. But for the purpose of this MRE and getting my calories in, I must. It's a must, look at that. Mm. Everything is so dry. That must be why it can, it can last for three years. It's hot. <laughs> oh man. Let me pull this thing out, guys. Man, this thing is hot, hot. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Let's see what these potatoes hitting on, guys. Oh. These things are not easy to open. I'll tell you that now. Come on. Don't do me like that, potatoes. Come on, potatoes. Let me try the other side, guys. Try not to make a mess. By the time I get in here, it's gonna be cold. Definitely need to have you a knife or something. Can anybody see the smoke? Can you see that? This thing is lit right now lit i couldn't do it guys i had to get some scissors i couldn't wait no longer oh man look at that oh this is not for the week oh look at those potatoes <laughs> oh they had better potatoes I've had better bacon. Mm. Oh man. Why? All right, so before we start a fire out here, cause it's getting real with this thing right here. Look at that, see all that smoke? 
getting real. Let's go ahead and bust open this apple turnover. All right. Let's, ship, let's finish off with a bang. Let's see what we got. Come on. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay. Good eats. That's good. That's good stuff right there, guys. Mm. Best part of the meal. Apple turnover. Who would have thought? That's good. When you're out there fighting for your country, and you are hungry, dehydrated, you need your water. Look, man, this meal right here is probably a 10 out of 10. But I'm going to go ahead and give it a... Oh, man. The apple turnover was legit. Everything else was just like super dry. The potatoes, hash browns, obviously a no-go for me. I don't really eat hash browns that like that, so... It wasn't that good. It was like soup. I gotta give it a four, guys. I'm afraid to bust open that coffee. So I'm gonna just drink mine. And I'm gonna catch you guys at the next one. All right, guys. Meal number two. We got chicken burrito bowl. I got my knife this time. Can't catch me slacking twice. Look at that. Easy, look at that. So this is obviously gonna be our entree right here. We got a cinnamon bun for dessert. Looks like these come with all the packets because I have some coffee in here again. And we have the gum, the wipes, of course, and some seasoning. So this looks like it's a mandatory thing. We got some orange juice this time, guys. Another cheese spread. We got some recovery trail mix, which is clutch because I just finished up my workout. We got a hot water bag. And we have our warming up bag right here. This is to warm up the food. We got just a cardboard to put the entree in like earlier. And we have our tortillas right there. So let's get to it. Looks like I'm getting better at this. Ooh, you can hear it cooking. Yes, sir. So normally you want to keep that slanted up. So I'm gonna put it right here. Keep it slanted. Can you see that? Yeah, there you go. Let's get some of this trail mix. Look like a whole bunch of chickpeas. We got pretzels. We got, oh, we got some peanuts, some almonds, cashews. Looks like a whole bunch of chickpeas to me. Yep. course the driest food ever trail mix not bad oh yeah yeah okay it's cooking so while that's cooking up i'm gonna go ahead and get my tortillas ready there it is right there so we only got two of them nice and soft too Let's see what kind of seasonings we got in here oh we got some hot sauce all right, guys, I think it's about ready. I don't need it to cook for too long, you know what I mean? Just warming it up. It's hot, so be careful. Nice, mushy, soup-type vibe, <laughs> as always. Let me see what's inside here. See, it opened up easier this time around. This morning, I had a hard time. Can you guys see that? Get a nice little view. Let's see what we got inside. We got cooked chicken. We got some long grain rice. We got some diced tomatoes, chili peppers. Got some pinto beans, some corn. It's lit. So before I put it in my tortilla, let me go ahead and try it out. Mm -hmm. Not bad, man, not bad. I don't do a lot of cheese, so I'm not going to use the cheese spread. I just don't like cheese that much. Not my style, guys. Go ahead and throw this all in the tortilla.
Grab me some hot sauce. <laughs> Don't be jealous, guys. Do not be jealous. Whoo! Oh, they got that aged cayenne pepper in here. Oh, man. Aged. That's too hot. But I'm going ahead and throw it on there for you guys. That's different. Oh, man, that's different. So here we go. It's standard, man. It's standard. I like to roll my burritos up. Hot sauce on my burrito, baby. Mmm. Hot. But this is pretty good. Mm-hmm. Alright, guys. Let's go ahead and see what this cinnamon bun is talking about. Ooh, excited. It looks just like the dessert from this morning. It looks just like it. <laughs> oh man, it's killing me. Look at that. It looks just like this morning. No cap, y'all already. Y'all saw it. Too good. Oh my God. I'm with it, man. Mm. That's good. Look at that. Mm. This meal right here, guys, not that bad. Got a nice burrito bowl, some good ingredients. Warmed it up, tastes great. Nice tortilla. Got some trail mix with some good, healthy nuts in it. And we got a cinnamon bun. Look, guys, these aren't going to be the best meals, all right? But you can manage with these, man. I'm giving this one right here. Let's be honest, it cannot, I cannot give it a 10 out of 10. I just can't. There's, there's no way I can give it a 10 out of 10 because that means it was super, super legit on a perfect level, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and give it an 8 out of 10. I forgot to use my salt. A little salt. You need your salt when you're out there, guys, working out, when you're sweating dehydrated and all that you gotta get you some salt in guys don't be afraid of the salt go ahead and put the put the hot sauce in there they don't give you much hot sauce in this packet i'm not gonna mess around with the oj with the orange powder beverage because i got my water right here guys i don't need it and plus i don't have a small water bottle we're gonna load this one up yes sir mm -hmm. all right guys I'm gonna finish up this meal and I'm gonna catch you guys at dinner. All right, guys, we got the last meal. This is dinner right here. Beef goulash. What is beef goulash? I actually have no idea what beef goulash is. So I'm actually curious to see what it tastes like and what it even looks like, you know? So let's break this in, all right? Hey, let's imagine we just did some work out there in the field, all right? Super hungry. Need some food, need something to drink, need some rest. All right. We got this stuff. Hey, look, you should be a professional by now. Two meals, coming at your third meal, dinner, you should be a beast. You should be running through this. We got us some patriotic cookies, guys. Patriotic cookies. We got some chunky peanut butter. I love peanut butter. We have, oh nice, we have some milk chocolate cocoa powder. I'm gonna make this this time. I haven't had any of the MRE drinks in the first two meals, so I'm going to drink this, okay? I have no idea what it tastes like. We have some applesauce. <laughs> oh man, we have our warmer. I'm so hungry right now that I'm not even gonna use the warmer. I eat this crap cold. I mean, it's not that good anyways, right? Who cares? Got the white wheat snack bread. That's it? I'm like, what, what, what is this? A piece of bread? Ah, probably for the peanut butter. All right, and of course, we got the normal salt. You know, we got a beverage in here. This actually got cranberry grape beverage in here. Uh, okay, they're getting fancy on us. All right, so this is the beef goulash. Inside the beef goulash, we have brown rice, spinach, carrots, tomatoes, and smoked pap paprika. Sounds pretty good, actually. As you see, I'm moving pretty fast. You gotta be fast when you're out there, guys. Sometimes you don't even have time to sit down. You gotta move. All right. 
This is what it's looking like. Go ahead and show you guys. Get a nice spoonful. Oh, look at that goulash. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, if you're out there in the field, you are starving, you are hungry, you are ready to eat. This is gourmet. Yes, this. This is gourmet. All right. Now, if you are at home in your own kitchen, like myself, this is not gourmet. But we can give this a nice five out of ten. You know what? I'm going to raise my points up because this, this is good. I've right, got the applesauce. Looks like we can just drink it. You still want to be sanitary, so you don't want to put your mouth all on it. So, you know, try not to get too messy with it. But, mm -hmm. that is some sweet applesauce. I see, it has 26 grams of sugar. Yeah, it better be sweet. Good gosh, it's pretty good too. Not better than my cinnamon bun from earlier. All right, so my hands are getting messy. So I'm actually gonna use my napkin, my trusty napkin right here, so I can be clean, guys. It's all about being clean, right? Oh, lots, lots of napkins actually. Okay, okay. Keep it clean, guys. Keep it clean. All right, let's get in there with this. We're gonna put, we use the bread. We're gonna put some peanut butter on the bread. Now, I can't exactly remember what the peanut butter tastes like. Do not eat. Please do not eat. So, don't know why I'm eating all this. It tells you not to eat. Okay. I'm going right in with the peanut butter. Looks like they cleaned it. Smells clean. Hmm. I don't have a knife. I don't want to use my goulash spoon to, you know, get a nice spray going. So, whatever. I right, dry. Way too dry. Mm, but to me the peanut butter is outstanding i definitely need some something to drink now so that's what we have all right so i'm going to clean it off first got a little messy earlier with my lovely applesauce do not feel past this line right here there's a line on there must be that do not feel line lots of sugar in here all right let's get in here Ziploc because what we're gonna do is probably shake it up. So, I mean, some of it is common sense, guys. I got my water right here. Normally, you have your little canteen or something. Can't quite see. That's good enough. Shake that bad boy up. I'm horrible with this because this <laughs> I eat just about anything. But if I'm out there, this is a bomb meal right here. Mm. Zip that back up. We're gonna save a little bit for later. For my goulash. <laughs> Alright, let's get into cookies. Got the patriotic cookies. Sugar cookies to be exact. Let's see what we got. Oh, look at that. Well, well, well. Got us some sugar cookies, guys. Check it out. Oh. <laughs> you know, small, you know. It's sugar and everything else except for these cookies. I wash it down with my powder. My milk chocolate beverage. Mm -hmm. 
get some more of this goulash. Guys, don't forget what that goulash was looking like. Remember that? Mm -hmm. All right, guys. I'm gonna have to give this meal an eight out of 10, okay? I'll give it an eight out of 10. I love peanut butter. I do not love the bread that they gave me, but I do love peanut butter. So it takes this meal so many points up. The applesauce is some delicious applesauce. I'm not even gonna lie. The cookies are a great small little treat. That's what the peanut butter looks like, guys. It's not like it's not something crazy. I forgot the jam, guys. guys that is it for this video three meals three mres meals ready to eat uh don't count them out yet all right go to the store go to amazon go somewhere get you some mres man and try it out for yourself i actually enjoyed most of them they all weren't bad and they all aren't bad i think there's like 20 plus mre menus out there all right and some of them are super tasty and some of them are probably horrible. All right, I have not had them all, but I had a few. The ones I had today were pretty good. I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. With that being said, you give this video a thumbs up for me. Subscribe if you aren't already. And let me know, man, if you wanna see me do anything, any food challenges, if you have any questions on fitness, got any videos you would like me to do, some knowledge that you would like to get. Look guys, let me know, I'm here for you. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate the love and I'm gonna catch you in the next video.